Hello guys, welcome back to Pentesters Club. Today I would like to clarify about the various transfers of BC many many intermediaries are unfortunately have no idea in this field of high finance and do not know the background of these transactions. Many of these ridiculous high sums come from private placement programs. It's called PPP. So and are available on bank servers not an account so this private placement is available on the bank servers not in the uh, humanitarian projects okay the reason for this is simple parts of these funds are to be invested in the humanitarian projects but the owners do not have humanitarian projects in which is why the bank cannot put the money on their accounts the use of human projects will be example like strictly tested by the federal governments. So, if you want to run any private placement programs, so you need to have one at least one government project or else your own project or else your company project. So, you just invite your uh, programmers uh, or else investors. Uh, with your uh, program so if they are in ready to invest they will give you a block funds and uh, otherwise they will do a direct wire transfers if they are in more reliable to you then you need to give uh, at least 200 percent extra profit of their income in certain of 40 days or else more short time period okay uh, next so the owners are looking for a way to get the funds free often this is done through a fund foundations so you need to give him back like a foundations after this like a private placements every bankers knows that uh, we are in gray area here since we are in gray area we are all due to obligate to secure the secure to completely everyone so how this uh, firm or business persons will earn extra 200 percent in their 40 percent of their invested money so this will start with uh, maximum 40 million to 100 million private placement program so next we are going to discuss about ipip so ipip this always happens when both bank officers discuss and check the deal directly it always check the check from both bank banks uh, bankers need complete kyc and proof of capital the procedures must be discussed on bank to bank often transfer times quotes are to be considered very often unrecoverable main accounts have to be created to send important quotes also like blocking code accessing code prn code internal blocking code and final code is most important which purpose of guarantee receiver bank can give so then and only the sender bank will release a lot of intermediaries are most cunning guys and foxes in this financial marketing things so they play in their way okay and they don't even get you in the field also perform guarantee and communication communicated through these accounts so how you want to communicate through it's bank to bank communications also but these mandates will communicate through whatsapps or uh, facebook's or some other platforms 
or else some private platforms also available for their own uh, priorities and uh, majority will be done uh, successful jobs in face to face only i will show you everything how this ip ip accounts is created and how to perform these things and everything in the live demo and next ip id so uh, this ip id is a is a one financial transaction in the swift operations it should be done bank to bank is a mandatory as a both bank have to clarify the ttm for the transfers the bank officers have to send the code to the counter code without ttm and ip id is not feasible as both bank officers have to sit at their desk at the same time both have sent the imfa both have to agree the various explanations example execution guarantee tax burden release the money must be guaranteed the transaction itself take only a few seconds each sender must aware of the receiver have has very high cost taxes in each country and bank fees to pay the total cost of the receiver in hong kong example 35% of the other countries even more so hong kong take 35% of the taxes and 5% uh, of the downloading fee and how much uh, receivers percentage here that should be in the contract also and senders percentage and their mandates percentage and xyz percentage who is a rest upon n persons over there so in any type of transactions so you need to pay the burden of taxes from your country as well as the sender's country also okay again ddc direct transfer and clearing code so at ddc it's very often matter of state funds or government funds from this we can see the actual banking system also the states under control the transmitter sends the receiver is liable again editing without the direct contact of both bank officer is absolutely impossible once it was sent to the any of the receiver's branch and it can't able to editable but it can be redirectable any type of financial transactions or instruments fx4 the system actually obliged by the dutch bank and never nevertheless my groups can still use it today and have a account in germany for use so for this you need kyc contact from bank to bank communication it's not money but file sent by decrypted by the receipt again so in fx4 so uh, you are sending an xml file and upload into the swift uh, uh, messaging center and that should be making a transaction okay fx4 is not necessary in many cases these are often better ways to a transfer like ip ip dtc fx4 manual download these things sepa so sepa has two ways uh, first one is normal sepa simple direct debit authorization 
so it's immediately feasible the account business sepa is much more complicated must be applied for the bank immediate credit receiver have to be a credit worthy and must have very high credit limit also in this possible bankruptcy must be clarified bank is liable very big effort duration is 2 weeks only bank to bank is feasible receiver could lose his account also tax liability of the receiver in the country in some countries europe to observe a negative interest rate also at sepa business the receiver must protect himself fakes therefore kyc and proof of capital capital absolutely necessary for uh, sepa transactions do you understand what i am telling everything so these are the ma- majority of transactions is required in the sepa so basically what i would like to tell you in a single way the straight forward to all these type of transactions with pro swift the sender wants something from us that's why the sender has show up the show up and disclose everything there are they are safe ways to do without scattering everything mandate or mandate or bank to bank communications if a sender do not accept this he is hiding something and will not proceed by me i have a way every clean kind of transactions even for any type of uh, transactions i do not answer quotes without first having fact because every transfer different and needs to be discussed individually also taxes are different in each country which is why a quota can only be quoted when the deal is discussed and the country in which it is made is known nobody has to worry about his commissions the banks must strictly adhere to the rules of the icc and must not allow themselves any mistakes or scams otherwise they may lose the license in my attitude i prefer 0.1% is enough of lot money then 5% of is nothing so if you fight for 5% and uh, some mandates like uh, i have some uh, big files like ipip dbc kbc fx4 manual download as i am working in financial institutions so i have a bb by right he was transferred uh, some 5 billion dollars worth of money and this mandate i want 15% if you won't pay a 15% i will cancel the deal the sender is a legate person and this mandate will demand the receiver and their uh, receiver mandates like this but the transaction is hold by the mandate if you agree with the receivers our receivers have also many problems so the mandate need to understand the what is the receivers mandate capabilities and everything and receivers also uh, senders also paid here taxes once he was credited over into his account from the global server the receiver uh, will uh, will detect the taxes and paid uh, from his account so he was paid successfully once receiver is downloaded from the global server and receiver has to pay the taxes in his government uh, after giving the bank and or spgl then uh, they will pay us they will pay to the first government uh, the taxes after that they will pay to each and every one what i was told you everything clear so once we come back to here so so this is the swift operations so i would like to show you something so once you want to log in the swift i show you you forget so here 
swift.com so all these type of like uh, ipap dpc ipid alliance like to uh, each and operations will be done from here swift.com so who know have a knowledge of these things so please uh, flow the swift operations you will get each and everything some countries have swift access some countries no have a swift access okay so the senders is 100% legit persons okay the mandates who will play as a member of uh, in the like forest like a foxes like a cunning animals okay they want to steal the money and in 2019 a case was arised with the neighborhood immobile and uh, as well as some other bb biotech uh, these mandates has stolen the money and never paid to the uh, sender so there was arise the cases also uh, they was changing the intermediary payments details and uh, they are not allowing to touch with the receivers the receiver paid to the central bank uh, their uh, taxes and everything they paid to the mandates and the mandates is switch off and everything so this is what like cunning fees in the working of financial transactions every transaction is more important in the financial transactions but it's very bit more complicated also so i will show you now uh, the thing so here you just need to uh, click on login once you visit here so uh, in these things uh, you need to create an account first so once you was created an account so your email address should be an uh, corporate email address if you put gmail hotmail uh, any other emails it won't accept the bank once you go for verification with the bank identification code and you are taking a link up thing with the swift it never accept okay so i'm not going to show you this registration part and everything i am skipping this so once you was registered and uh, they will after registration you need to verify your email address so that should be in corporate email after verifying your corporate email uh, they will link uh, they will add your uh, your mobile number for security purpose and they will add you a qr QR code or else Google authentication code. They will give separate authentication app for this, not in the Play Stores or App Stores. That is in the Swift operations only. And you just download and uh, link up with your mobile app device. Once you've done successfully, then I will show you now. Okay. So you just close this. Close this also. So I just refresh this. So this is my Swift operations. So your operational portal is this one. So I just verified everything here. So so institution name you need to create here your uh, company name. So you need to register in your company, uh, in your country. So if I stay in India, I want to register my company with the Indian government, with the MCA portals, uh, incorporation certificate number, and everything they will ask you here okay after bic verification so that company name should be validated here with your company registration number everything uh, and uh, which so uh, type of source and what purpose you want to use as swift operations and everything so here you can see iso 2022 alliance light to alliance cloud release and find uh, 5 release 7.6 security attention swift uh, platform uh, swift web access relationship management application swift api swift gpa swift solutions for yes miz transaction screening upgrade universal confirming mt1 confirmations of mt103 iso smart new to swift administrator 
administrator your swift compilers and uh, shared services customer security program messaging and standard release secure your operation swift gpa work with messages alliance cloud so in this uh, we would like to see uh, everything one by one so i would like to click on explore document so in the this is a normal swift uh, okay for the documentation we would like to see about swift uh, swift is an a operational center is an like a massive operational center uh, which will give a high security and confidentiality availability and integrity to one bank to another bank uh, with the secured communications okay many type of uh, senders or receivers will request uh, i want md199 i want uh, and this seven double nine. This is nonsense things. We can't able. This Swift is a just a message message operational center. Bank to bank. If bank can give an MT one double nine to the uh, sender bank can give to the MT one double nine to the receiver bank. Okay, Swift can pass that message to a receiver bank. Swift is a like a modem or a router. That's it. Business intelligence, watch uh, banking analytics. So you can see in the product cate category. So in the business intelligence, Swift index, watch banking analytics, watch banking analytics premium, watch banking insights, watch banking uh, analytics, watch message code analytics, watch security analytics, watch uh, security insights, watch traffic analytics. So for compilings, you need to give your KYC register, your uh, banking details first. You need to mention your banking details, bank address, uh, and uh, your uh, tax or GST, tax ID, company registration number. Everything should be mentioned in the one PDF. Okay. Once you are going for registration. Okay, I will show you how to register now for KYC. So, connectivity to Swift and share in infrastructure program. So, that I will show you uh, further. So, interface with the integrations like Alliance Access Kit. So, for everything IPIP, DPC, KPC, FX4, manual download, Alliance Lite 2, uh, everything they use Alliance uh, software for this type of operations okay fin the global solutions of swift provider for reliable and uh, rapid exchange of financial messages so reference data registry provider and security 3s keys customer security program and swift certificate center also services solutions for business areas for clearing swift for uh, corporate swift gpi Swift standard, Swift standard uh, read, readiness portal, standards MD, standards MX. So IBAN plus LEI file, local uh, local language file, payments plus uh, SEPA plus. So I discussed no SEPA how the SEPA uh, works here in the Swift also. BIC means bank identification code. How you will get a bank identification code, I will show you now. Okay. Bank directory of SEPA, bank directory plus, and everything. And Alliance Slide 2 Swift Connect, Swift Certified Specialist. Uh, specialist. This uh, will see further. So, uh, this is a uh, normal Swift operations. Once come back. So this is normal, normal only. So product A to Z here you can see bank directory, clearing, collateral management, IBAN plus everything you will get here. Watch traffic analytics also you can get it here. Interest. 
personal data protections also is available is updated in swift because of bangladesh uh, hack performed in uh, 2016 or i don't know the particular date i was heard in news bangladesh hack the swift operations so you can see many things is available watch billing analytics watch banking insights these are all common things here come back security and standard measures also is uh, updating updated everything here cash management everything so we can see now uh, swift smart so this application is temporarily unavailable because the application try to access temporarily offline for the maintenance reasons please try again later for more in information on plan maintenance please visit the operational status page terms and conditions so if you want to maintain a swift in offline process so you need to contact this contact numbers and you they will give you a special support for you to do the operations okay so uh, once i click here uh, dlc institution and uh, click your edit profile so i would like to register an institute now okay so once you come here new slide identify my swift it was coming here again profile request an access come to the profile and request an access so how we can find a bic what is bic bic means bank identification code is also called as an swift code so i would like to search one swift code hsbc um, so i just search uh, one swift code so click here I didn't get here. RFC code. Select. Okay, I just select something. Bank branch. So here is the Swift code. So I just copy this HSBC IN BB EC. So I click on register and institute, enter the uh, BIC code and click on go. So it's invalid. So we can try. HSBC German uh, Swift code.
so we can try DLC is invalid. Uh, one second, guys. Identity code, EDC code, I do not know. Let's see. Login server company date test. So I just am entering some accounts like uh, some uh, someone's account like uh, some any random uh, Swift code HK UK GB 4B X, X, X. Let's go. It's invalid. DLC. So let's try with this. So here, HSBS UK bank, uh, bank PLC. Next. So this email address is not allowed for the selected institution because. I was created with a normal email address so that's never take I just told you before only okay so you can't able to register in the Swift okay you if you want to register on a Swift you just try with your corporate email and uh, professional phone number so that can be work after you was registered in the Swift operations then what you want to do is so you want to do a only simple thing as a thing like if you want to access a swift once uh, after you was approved the swift operations then you just need to write with any white paper white a4 sheet paper and a letter of intent with your hand okay not write in the systems and type and pay, uh, make your uh, electronic signatures and uh, sign and stamp and uh, send it to the, your bank that never works here okay take an a4 sheet and write an letter of intent to your bank so i want to use with uh, an swift operations for uh, for financial operations like IPIP, BTC, KTC, FX1, manual download, SPLC, LC, bank guarantees and many other operations like Swift GPI, GPA, semi-automatic, manual download, KTT, any type of operations. So you just mention whatever the operations you want, these things and mention your account, your branch in the LOI and you just sign and you just put your company stamp and everything and here should be your company uh, name and everything so this banker will send to the central bank that central bank will send to the world bank the world bank will give you a call here for an interface and uh, there is a uh, three interview rounds they will ask you some certain questions so you need to pass that certain questions it's a very simple and uh, easy okay if you can pass that certain questions 
uh, you will get an uh, swift access once you get an uh, swift access it will be displayed on you here so which type of mode of operations you want to take it and uh, work so you down you take it like ip ip you want to take it or dtc ktc fx4 manual download uh, swift mt103 gpi semi automatic uh, gpi or uh, manual download or any other things uh, can be workable here or align slide to or anything after they was given you you need to maintain minimum 5 million to 49 million dollars worth of money for accessing these softwares is free okay and if you want to uh, open these accounts like ip ip dtc ktc fx4 manual download and anything so you need to maintain 5 million dollars uh, worth of money in your bank account and later here we can see your operational portal this is your operational portal my tools now uh, sweet a smart operational status so my status because India has banned 2016 when my president was elected in 2016 as of Bangladesh uh, SWIFT had the rule so they was permanently closed the SWIFT access so we can't able to access the SWIFT operations in India so again my profile my config notifications share documents release timeline so here is the total tools is available here updated date also will be released here here you can see align slide 2 you need to pay off million uh, to act to upgrade align slide 3 uh, for this one so you can do an uh, in align slide 3 uh, IP IP DTC KTC FX4 manual download and IP ID or any other operation operational things so once it was uh, you download from here softwares uh, there is an a uh, softwares and uh, same login credentials and uh, they will also give you one uh, 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 private certificate so you need to import that private certificate that will give you an a, a new password generator for every time once it was generated you can see here align slide 2 and you was login over there and whatever the banking details which was given in the LOI as well as uh, here you was uploaded in the KYC so that will be given to you with one IP address once you was login so that you, whatever the IP IP sender is given that IP address is activated otherwise it's not activated entity plus alliance entry aligned alliance access alliance entity payments control everything alliance wizard swift GPI uh, sanction testing payment controls observer insights april 2022 so swift gpi observer insights case management so you was transferred from uh, once uh, one sender either uh, bb biotech or immobilin partner is transfers to uh, uh, indonesian country or else uh, db bank germany he was transferred five billion dollars worth of money and uh, the receiver is failed to receive and the mandates are used of fighting for the commissions or uh, some other things so the sender can put an observation on this file and he was redirected to upon end receiver 
so the opponent receiver what he can do the opponent receiver can take that the utr code and he was uh, take the utr code and locate the funds so he don't like to see and uh, that the banker uh, the receiver no need to see maximum capacities and everything if they have capacity to do uh, that uh, transaction so what they can do they just redirect the funds with the utr code once the utr code is entered they was display the uh, transaction file with the md199 and every document okay they will request send md199 send these things so these and all very nonsense things whatever they talk okay you don't need md199 no need md199 md799 uh, message transactional function function activities here in the swift or else bank to bank so the bank need to endorse the pgl once the trn of funds is available over there once it's available the sender will release the final code once he verify the bank endorses pgl only then you go for downloading once you download it then get paid with the very equality of icc once you come to here current So it's available many softwares you can download here. So the main softwares of IPIP, DTC, KTC, FX4, manual download, IPID, or uh, Swift GPI, Swift Automatic, uh, GPI or Semi-Automatic, or MP103 Direct Wire Transfer. So you need to have funds in your account, then you can transfer to receiver's account. So that should be also an, a special software and FX4 is an a XML support uh, process also. So that's you know very well out of support. So in FX4, uh, once you was uh, selected uh, for downloading the softwares and use of operational things. Okay. Uh, I would like to give us uh, one best example. Mm. Uh, gas extra NC as a company okay uh, this gas extra NC company once he was registered and approved he was uh, selected for his operations like IPIP DTC Swift GPI Swift uh, semi-automatic uh, uh, GPS uh, GPI MD103 uh, GPS semi-automatic and uh, align slide 2 uh, but he they won't perform align slide 2 they was transferred an ipip like 5 billion 10 billion and they was have uh, options to convert that ipip to an a uh, swift gpa also so uh, this is the software for analyzers only okay and uh, you can download the softwares once you was approved the swift operations with uh, your bic code okay so that I was shown here, Swift.net Alliances. Here, once it was applied here. So thank you guys for watching. Have a nice day. So I hope you was very useful for this tutorial. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and share this video to your friends and who want to gain the knowledge in the financial transactions. Please contact to me. I can help you to reach many persons in the financial transactions like IPIP, DTC, KTC, FX4, manual download, everything. So I can also perform IPIP, DTC, KTC, FX4, manual download, SBLCs, gold, diamonds and everything. You can contact me anytime if you can really can perform only. So we won't give you any MT199, any nonsense things, we can provide you a TRN, you just look at the funds and you just give me the bank and or SPGA. Swift is only like a message functional activities from bank to bank, a secure communications. MT199 is nothing, MT799 is nothing, MT760 is nothing. Work of performance is majority in the contracts. Okay. Thank you guys, have a nice day.